So lads, we are here, episode 23, and the final episode of season 1 of the Newcastle United career mode. If you've been watching, we have won the Carabao Cup, we finished in the top 4, we lost in the FA Cup final in the last episode, if you want to go and say that, it was a very entertaining game. We can still finish third. I, I, we can finish second, but it will be like a, pretty much impossible with um, Liverpool will have to lose both our oh, not calendar um, league. Liverpool will have to lose both their games, or you will have to probably win both our games. But we've got Arsenal in the next game. If we were to beat Arsenal, we would go third, and then with Everton at home last game of the season, uh, potentially um, to finish third. But we'll have to wait and see. Everton a certain thirty of league table at the bottom. Stays how it is. Ipswich, Leicester and Southampton have all been relegated. But we've got top four. We've been a bit on funny form at the minute. We've won one game out of four. So it's a tough game to bounce back versus Arsenal. I'll advance to it now and I'll show you the team that I'm going to play. So this is a team. Obviously, there is a couple of changes from our last game. Obviously, Longstaff's back in midfield. We've got Dan Burden because both Botman and Mark Gay have got no fitness. And Livermento got red carded in the FA Cup final. So that COVID carries over to the league, which means Kevin Trippier will play. It's not the best lineup. A lot of changes do need made made for the summer next year, so expect some signings to come in. Obviously, from now on, leave comments in the um, comment section down below of signings that I shouldn't make. But Arsenal away, really tough game. A chance to get third in the league. Let's see what we can do. How are then Arsenal away? Final away game of the season. Let's see what we can do. Oh. I had nothing on, so I thought I'd just shoot it. I, I thought it wouldn't go in, but close. Bang. Oh, man. We're getting chances. We're playing, we're playing actually, Harvey's. We just can't put the ball in the back of the net. Good save. And that's half time. Nil nil. I mean, both teams have had good chances. I think we've had probably the better of the actual chances that have been. that have happened, but. Fit the lads are doing now, considering the team we've got. Obviously, the defence is completely made. We've got Trippier burning, long staff in. We're not doing too bad. Nil nil at half time. Brilliant dribbling by Anthony Gordon. And he has Isaac. Oh, it's a great chance just before. Just for. Oh, man. Half. That was. Well, I was trying to say the second half just started. Had a great chance, but. Oh. Corner in the 90th minute. Still nil nil. Need a good ball in. Which it is. Oh, it's going to bounce all over. One minute. I've had a time. And we've still got the ball. Isaac. Oh my god. This is the last chance of the game. Anthony Gordon. Still on. Don't blow your whistle. Don't blow your whistle. Don't blow your whistle. Oh my god, I don't know what to do with it, damn burn. Oh my god. Nah, it's going to be full time now. It is full time, nil nil. I think it was at the point of first nil nil of the whole season. And it's a team that's sitting third in the league. I mean, it's not a bad result. But if we want to finish third, oh, Liverpool have won. So we'll have a look at the league table going into the last game of the season. So, I'm looking at the league table for the last game of the season. We can still finish third. Arsenal have got Southampton away. The league title still hasn't been decided. Literally one point. Man City have drew an extra game compared to what Liverpool have. Pretty much the rest of the table speaks for itself. Um, sevens are still not confirmed either Chelsea or Fulham. Around the league, mid-table doesn't really matter. Then obviously we know bottom of the league um, is still the same. So the lead t table still hasn't been decided. We're going to still finish third. I think third in our first season would be remarkable. But with eight defeats this season, it's, we need to improve in, in that sort of sense. But last game of the season, we've got Everton, who are sitting 13th in the league. Should win. But look, even if we do finish fourth, I don't think you can complain. And that's going to be the team. Who stays from this team going into the next season? And after this game as well, obviously I know there's a lot of contract situations. I'm going to do as many as I can with the budget that we've got because I know we don't have as much budget because we spent a lot in January to get Ian Manson in. So I'm going to have to have a look at that. But for the final time this season, that's the team we're going to play. Everton at home. Top four is secured. Can we get third place? And for the final time this season at St James's Park, how are you the lads? 
How's that not a card? The one that Tino done in the um, FA Cup final was exactly the same, if not as bad. And he hasn't even got a card for us. I might just shoot me. I've just decided to shoot from this free kick. Sandro Tonali. Oh! Get in! Who's that? Number Ian Manson on the rebound. I don't know if that hit the post or the keeper. I saved it. But one they're up after two minutes, last game of the season. Yeah, you love to say it. I, I am so bad on free kicks. On it's, I've always been on FIFA. I just decided to hit the cut with Tenali. It. Oh, Pickford saved it, but he's just not kept a hold of it. And Ian Manson puts it in the bottom corner. That boy's be his first goal for Newcastle. One nil. Joe Linton. Oh. -ho -ho! 2-0 after 6 minutes where, where was this versus Arsenal that is a beautiful finish by the captain Joe Linton you love to see it he's going to be a big part of next season I hope, hope he's in the peak now 83 rating hopefully he's rating go a little bit higher great way to end off the season so far 2-0 after 6 minutes Sandro Tonali on the free kick oh it's on target Fulton Pickford spilt it again <laughs> Off the ball! How's that not gone in? Oh my god! Joe Linton could have had a double. Would be an absolutely all over these, like. Absolutely all over them. And Bremo! Off oh, off the ball! We've hit the ball twice now in this game. Oh my god, 28 minutes in. And we're absolutely smashing them so far, like. I don't think they've even had a shot. Oh, Anthony Gordon's won it! Against his old team! Anthony Gordon! Oh my god, he's missed! He's it's a brilliant save by Pickford. I can't remember if Gordon scored against Everton away last time. I, I can't remember, but right before half time, we've absolutely battered Everton. We really have. The fans are bouncing in the stadium there. S 17 shots. Wow. 17 shots. I don't think there's a way either to actually check the scores in the other games, like as of now. Um, I don't think there is, but 17 shots. Wow. I'm only 2-0 up. That's quite embarrassing, to be fair, like. Oh, we can see there. Southampton scored, but then Arsenal have scored again. As it stands, we're still in fourth. But, look, it doesn't really matter. I don't I don't think it matters. I don't think you get any extra money or anything, but... I, obviously, I'd prefer to finish third than fourth than anyone would. And is that it, boys? It is. That is it. The end of the 2024-25 season. The fans are going I, I'm in the crowd. Like, is that because we've got Champions League football? I, I don't know, but we don't. I don't know if third place has been secured. I'm going to watch this through just in case if anything does happen. Um, but I will go for all the stats. We'll go for the league table. We'll go through clean sheets. We'll go through top goal score. I think we'll know who has got top goal score, and not just for us, for like the whole league. And we'll see how good have done in that as aspect. But look, we scored two goals in the first six minutes. A 2 0 win, good stuff. Looking at the results, Arsenal won, as you see, as you can see there. Man City won, so they've won the Premier League title. And that is it. We will go for everything and end off the episode of the last one of the season. League table wise, eight points off top of the league. I'm very satisfied with that. Really good uh, stuff. We scored 98 goals this season. Wow. <coughs> Defensively, we've conceded a lot. I think we've conceded probably we've conceded the second most goals in the league. Um, it goes Southampton with seventy six, then us and Ipswich have both conceded sixty six. Leicester conceded sixty seven, but you've conceded because the webcams it doesn't matter. But we've done well in that aspect. Let's have a look at all like the league, um, all like the um, top goal scorers and stuff. So top goal scorer was Alexander Rizak. This is the only stat I've looked at. I've not looked at assists, clean sheets, and and, and anything else. Isaac gets 43 goals, Haaland with 31, Son with 30. Who got the most assists? Bruno G. Missed only the last three games of the season, played every single game. Then Joel Linton, Anthony Gordon, then Isaac. Does it, does it any more Newcastle players show? Oh, no. Wait, Harvey Bond's there with nine, and Bremo with nine. Um, good in that aspect. Really good on the uh, assists. Clean sheets, I don't think we're going to be up there. I mean, we did make some. Now we made nine. Only two off, to be fair, but. We got two clean sheets in the last two games, but that is that. 
that is that boys Rita I'm going to try and sort out some of this um, contract situation and then I will end off the episode there first one we've done there is Sean Longstaff he's got a new contract I'm going to give Sean Longstaff a new contract it's just the case of we need some cover one player who I'm probably not going to give a new contract to is Callum Wilson he's on 110 grand a week which I think is ridiculous and when I try, I try to do do it with him before. He doesn't want an extension. He only wants. He wouldn't let us give him an extension. I don't know why. And then all the other players like look, Emil Cross probably's not going to play anymore. Mark Gillespie won't. Dubravka won't. Um, Rudy and then Partison. I'm not too bothered about. I would want. I would want to keep Dan Burn, but he's going to Southampton. So I think the only one really that I've got to sort out was Longstaff. I, you know what? I'll try and get Wilton again, and then try and sell him on to make some money. But we'll, we'll, I'll see what I can do. Once, well, you know what? I'll accept it. What actually happens here? Does does he still have one month? Yeah, like this player. So I've just given Callum Wilson a new contract of three hundred and twenty grand bonus, but it wouldn't let us give him any more contracts. So you know what? Fuck him. Um, all the rest of them like hardly played this season. I don't think Emil Craft actually played a game this season. Um, we'll have a look at that, but we will. I think that will be it. I think we're just going to advance to next season and then start fresh for the next episode. Wait. You... Callum Wilson saving for Nottingham Forest. I'll give him a new contract with no extension. So I, I'm not really too bad. We will be signing a better backup striker anyways. That was straight on my mind. I just thought I could try to give him a new contract to sell him on. But we will advance to the end of the season. See what happens. And then going into the next season. I'm not going to spoil anything. To say he's been promoted. Transfer news or anything. It's all going to be in the next episode. So we'll end off the season. And that will be the end of season one. Fourth place in the Premier League. We were runners up in the FA Cup. We won the Carabao Cup. And then that doesn't matter. We're going to end the season there. And that is it for season one. New beginnings. Season two of the Newcastle United Career Mode will be probably coming out next week. This is going out Sunday. Um, this final episode. So the next one will probably be sometime next week. And that's going to be it. It, lads, it's going to be a roller coaster of a ride next season. We've got Champions League football to look forward to. I'm not going to look at anything. In my next episode, I'm going to be reacting to everything that happens in the career mode. There's Callum Wilson. He's gone. We're not even going to look at anything. I'm going to save it now, as you can see. Oh, God. Auto save and quit. And that is me done for the career mode until the next episode. Make sure to leave a like, boys, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you all in the next one. Yeah,